Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you guys having a Hyundai Sonata and you want to find where the telematics control module is located and how to replace it. Stay with us, we'll explain that in this video today. Before we start, let me tell you a little bit about us. Every single car we get at the garage, we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos. Why we do that? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need guys in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, that way we can keep making these absolutely free videos for you. If you need to buy any parts, tools for a good price and quick shipping guys check out the link in the description of the video below that's where we get all our tools and supplies from and you can save quite a bit of money so let's explain where that telematics control module is located and how to get to it in case you need to replace it uh, and this is specifically 2013 but it should cover the whole generation from 2010 to 2015 16 what we did guys we removed the radio if you want to see how to remove the radio it's on our channel we will teach you how to do that i know this car is nasty it's a parts car so we got it at an auction okay to use a few parts from it but it's nasty guys once you remove the radio and the radio panel here if you want to see it step by step check on the channel about radio replacement on Hyundai Sonata once you do that you come right here that's your telematics control module at that point the only thing that you need to do to replace it guys you have one screw here one there one here one here four screws the whole thing will come out and then you just replace the computer pretty simple it takes only a few minutes not too complicated at all hopefully the video will be helpful to any of you needing that help now if your bluetooth does not connect it could be because of that thing as well sometimes they could go bad but always check the wiring harness on the back side as well to make sure that everything's good uh, if you want to see anything else specific okay let us know we made quite a few videos on that car and if you want to see electrical videos components fuses check out the electrical car repair live channel if you want to see the mechanical one where we take the engine and transmission apart check out the repair guys there is more than 300 videos probably that will teach you how to mechanically fix your car hopefully the video will be helpful and see you guys next time